Hasta mudras. Hasta in Sanskrit means hand. And mudras mean gestures. Hasta mudras are the hand gestures. They are one of the most important elements in Bharatanatyam. If dance is a language, then every mudra is considered as a word. Thus, one could form a sentence and a paragraph using the combination of different mudras. Mudras are formed by the fingers of either single hand or double hand. Asamyutta hastas are the single hand gestures where each mudra can be held separately in both the hands. They are 28 in number. Samyutta hastas are double hand gestures where both the hands are combined together to form a single mudra. They are 24 in number. Using these single hand and double hand gestures, one could also learn different varieties of hand gestures like Dashavatara Hasta, Bandava Hasta, the Devata Hastas, and so on. Hasta mudras, when used in Dritta, the technical aspect of Bharatanatyam, does not convey any meaning. It just enriches the beauty of the whole movement. For example, if I use Katakamuka Hasta or Alapadma Hasta in Dritta, De, De, Tei, De, De, Tei, De, De, Tei, De, De, Tei. Here, this does not convey any meaning. It just adds beauty to the movement. Tei, ha, Tei, he, Tei, ha, Tei, he. But whereas the same mudra, Katakamukha and Alapadma, when used in Abhinaya, it could convey different meanings. For example, the Katakamukha could be used to pluck some flowers or it could be used to eat, to smell, to offer something. Similarly, Alapadma Hasta can be used to convey different meanings depending on the context. One could show or weave a whole story using these Hastamudras.